Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for March 3rd, 2020. Now this is Cooperite Rites of Passage. This is talking about a huge development. This is talking about having learned your lesson. You get to graduate boot camp <laughs> in a way or you get to come out of the woods. You find your way out of the, uh, the ritual, yes, that tested you that helped you learn. And now you'll get a bit of a respite. You'll get a chance to rest a little bit and to let some of these lessons sink in. So don't be surprised if today is one of those days of rumination, reflection, you know, all those good things where hopefully you don't look at it and go, oh, I'm so angry that that happened to me. I'm a feisty one myself. So I, I know what that's like to look back on stuff and be like, man, how'd they get away with that? <laughs> but sometimes these things and people will show up in our existence because we asked them to. We don't remember asking them to, but they did. And we played out a story, and now the curtain is coming down. So take a bow, go backstage, get yourself cleaned up, <laughs> right? and get on with your life. And that is what we're doing here today. Yes! So let that curtain fall on the old way of seeing your life, of seeing yourself. Don't expect bad things to happen. Don't expect that dangers around every corner. Or, amazingly enough, what I see and hear from a lot of people is that when things are going well, they're terrified that something bad's going to happen. So they're tapping into some knowledge that the universe is ever balancing. But it doesn't have to mean that the balancing comes from punishing you for enjoying your life. The balance might come where if you get an abundance of money, and then you're hanging onto it tightly out of fear, you might have, as we see it all the time with wealthy people, they get sued. And they usually lose. <laughs> well, some of you argue, no, the rich people have really great lawyers that help them out, blah, 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 blah. One way or another, their money ends up having to flow to something. That's balancing, okay? But let's say you have that abundance of money and you give freely to charity. Now you're balancing. And now nothing has to come to knock you out of that sense of having to hoard your money, <laughs> right? And nothing has to teach you a lesson. So that's the kind of thing that we're talking about here. Same kind of concept when you hang on too tightly to a relationship, it starts to spoil the relationship, right? It starts to foster a sense of distrust. So just bear that in mind. You're coming out of it today. Make notes. Today's a great day to journal to see what you're learning, all right? So I'm sending you all so much love and take care. Bye-bye.